popping socialites. It's your boy Billy Cash back with another episode of Social Climate. Shout out to everybody that support my video. Shout out to everybody that like the channel. Shout out to everybody that uh shares my videos. You know what I'm talking about? Let's get all the particulars out the way. You know what I'm talking about? Now in this episode right here, oh, we're going to Flint, Michigan, where we're talking about a man who has domestically abused a woman so much that she has shot him for attacking her 14 year old son this is so crazy stay tuned and you will find out the particulars of this story social climbing let's get it this podcast is brought to you by niggas who are generally concerned with most of the dumb shit that's going on right now by the way i'm your host billy cash aka cole and welcome to social climbing Socialites, let me tell you who you're looking at. You're looking at 43-year-old Damien Hodgins of Flint, Michigan, who has just been killed by his girlfriend. Now, there's rumors of domestic abuse between the two over the years, and he has a checkered past of being, like, I guess, a criminal. And uh, there's, there was something about a baby being killed in the early 2000s. I don't know. All I'm talking about is this situation right now. Now, what happened with Damien Hodges is in the Planet 3 Extreme Air Park in Flint, Michigan, there was an argument that took place between him and unnamed woman and the 14 year old boy. Now, they were in the car and they say it started from him not cleaning the snow off the car. Then she persisted to say that he wouldn't get a job. Then he proceeded to choke the living shit out of her. Now, at that point, people heard her saying, call 911, call 911. And a witness to the crime didn't know if she, if she was talking to him or someone was in the back seat because they didn't see the child. And from that point, they made it into the Planet 3 Extreme Air Park where he starts profusely beating the 14 year old up. Her 14 year old son. I don't know what happened. Maybe the kids said something. I mean, quite naturally, you're going to defend your mother, especially at age 14. And check out the video on this because he is profusely beating this boy like a grown man. Now, at the end of the day, we all are toxic people. We all have our own demons. We all snap at people. But to beat a child the way he did, it was only right for that mother to defend that child the way she did. And she came and shot him several times, killing the man. And prayers up to the Hodgins family, even though he might have been in the wrong, still prayers up because the loss of life is very bad. You know, socialites, this is stupid on a whole bunch of different levels. You got to learn how to control your anger. But check out some video on this, and I'm not coming back because this is stupid. As always, be careful and stay prayerful. And don't abuse kids because you might get killed. Billy Cash, gone. And we must warn you, some of the video you're about to see is violent, and it may be disturbing to some viewers. A place for family fun became the scene of a family feud here at Planet 3 Extreme Park in Flint. The January 18th shooting led to the death of 43-year-old Damon Hodges, but has been declared a case of self-defense. I believe her actions were reasonable under the law and I will not seek criminal charges against her. Authorities say prior to the incident, Hodges and a woman got into a heated argument. They argued over his refusal to remove the snow from her car and his failure to get a job. He then began to strangle her while sitting in the car. A witness in the parking lot describing to police what he saw and heard. He heard the woman being strangled say call 911 but was unsure if she was talking to him or to someone else in her SUV. The altercation moved inside where prosecutors say Hodges assaulted the woman's 14 year old son seen here in this surveillance video. The camera also captured what happened next. The woman pulled out a gun and shot Hodges several times killing him. Prosecutors say this wasn't Hodges' first assault on the woman or her son. This is the same young man that he put the belt around his neck and tried to strangle him. Officials say Hodges' background of violence dates back to 1993, assaulting a police officer, several women, and even his own child at just 16 days old, who later died. Hodges served 15 years in prison for that incident. Uh, that left her with brain damage. She was deaf and blind, and it was noted in the records that it was one of the worst assaults that the doctors down at Detroit Children's Hospital 
hospital had ever seen. Police say Hodges threatened to kill the shooter multiple times and even burned down her house with her inside. In a text message, he told her the police can't save you. I'm Jamie Sherrod, WNEM TV5. Click like and subscribe to my channel and hit the notification button. Yeah.